Welcome to www.knowwhatforyou.com Today's presentation is about radio frequency electromagnetic radiation emitted from an iPhone in different modes. Using a smartphone, you can stay connected all the time using email, internet, applications, text messaging and games. But did you know that during all these activities, and sometimes even when it appears to be idle, your smartphone transmits and emits radio frequency electromagnetic radiation? In the following video, please pay attention to when and for how long the iPhone emits radio frequency electromagnetic radiation. On the Cornet meters histogram, you can see the last 32 measurements from approximately the last 15 seconds. iPhone on idle mode when the Wi Fi is set on. 3G is off. Wi Fi was just turned on. The Wi Fi is initializing. The iPhone transmits short RF signals. If you take a look at the Cornet's ED85's histogram, you would be able to see the short RF signals. After the first transmission, the iPhone synchronizes via the Wi-Fi connection once every couple of seconds and emits radio frequency electromagnetic radiation. The iPhone seems to be idle, but it still emits short high radio frequency signals every couple of seconds. Surfing the Internet via 3G Network When surfing the Internet via the 3G Network, the iPhone is emitting radio frequency electromagnetic radiation. The page is still loading and the iPhone is still emitting. iPhone on idle mode when set to 3G network. The iPhone is now connecting to the 3G network. After the first synchronization, low level, fast changing radio frequency signals are emitted once in a while. More radio frequency electromagnetic radiation emission. And again. And again. And again. As we saw, the iPhone, as every smartphone, emits radio frequency electromagnetic radiation, even when you are not using it, as it synchronizes to the network. The length, level, and frequency of the transmissions depend on the smartphone's configuration and usage. For example, if you have lots of widgets and applications installed on your smartphone, it will transmit more often. So, if you want to limit your exposure, Turn off 3G and Wi-Fi communication when you are not using them. Better not use a smartphone at all. Please take this into consideration before buying your child a smartphone. Minimize the use of cell phones and wireless devices before the use will minimize you. For more info, please visit our website www.knowwhatforyou.com, our YouTube channel, our English blog, our Hebrew blog. Please join us on Facebook and Twitter. That's all for now. Thanks for watching and see you next time.